good morning everybody it wow. is very early it's i've been awake since six p2 woke me up at six o'clock uh shouting basically um and it is i've tried to get them to go back to sleep but they've decided they want to come downstairs before their grow clock turned uh yellow so we are up now and i thought i'd do a day in the life because i haven't filmed very much recently i've kind of been trying to reduce my content so i'm not really filming as much because there's only so many like days in the life that you can film but okay so i'm a little bit more awake than i was when i started the vlog um my husband is really not very well again i feel like this year all we're doing is being ill as a family um so i have decided to take the girls i've got p2 and p3 at home today because it's wednesday i'm going to take them to jump in on my own and hopefully have some nice girly time i don't ever really go out on my own like with them on a wednesday so it'll hopefully be quite nice to do that and i've just uploaded or i'm uploading my controversial parenting tag which should be up already by the time you see this vlog so i will leave the links below or here or here or wherever the heck i can put them um and yeah i don't know what else we've got to do in today p2 has horse riding as well at some point i don't know if i'll end up doing that on my own or if i'll come back and pick cubby up um and he'll can come and watch with us um p1 is at school today until like six o'clock so we've got quite a long day i like wednesdays not usually we would go to um essex and see my granddad and stuff like that we haven't done that for such a long time we need to do that because that was the whole idea of having p2 off nursery on the wednesday and p1 at school for the longest so yeah we need to do that but yeah i'm a bit more awake than when i started the vlog um it is now 20 to 9 so i need to just quickly upload this blog post and edit a couple of photos for it um so it can go live today and then i will be going to get showered really quickly and heading off to jump in so we've arrived at jump in i've just popped to the toilet um but i went the wrong way so i kind of had to double my journey which is really embarrassing and hopefully hubby didn't notice ended up jumping quite a bit but um p3 i don't know if she's just tired or what's wrong with her but she kept asking to go to the toilet which is brilliant because we're potty training we're like day five of potty training um and she kept asking to go which is like i said absolutely fine um but it felt like we were spending most of the time in the toilet which isn't great when you're paying like 12 pound to go trampolining um hopefully she sleeps on the way home we're just gonna head off it is awful weather today um hopefully it stops raining for the um for p2's horse riding which is in about an hour and a half two hours yeah, horse riding. so yeah we're gonna go now did you have a good time trampolining with mummy mm -hmm. yeah not, not with no this was a grumpy knickers wasn't she did you do the ladder all by yourself? Yeah. That was so clever, wasn't it? I did that. You did it, yeah. I'm How are you doing? I can't do anything. You're doing so well. Making your own sandwich, aren't you? Yeah. Are you doing well? Hey, doing a good job? Yeah. Well done. I like squidging it. Pat, pat, pat. I like squidging it. Next bit. So we've just popped home we've picked up hubby hubby's actually driving now um he is still not feeling very well but we are going to head off for horse riding it's still raining a little bit it's not like chucking it down but it is raining so i'm hoping that p2 still has a good time i mean she's got a coat and horses don't mind being out in the rain so it should be fine um and then we're going to go to the library i think because we need to change our books over so we're actually having a pretty busy day
And I should laugh, I'm not laugh doing and giggle and I can hear him laughing. She's like hiding behind there somewhere. I don't think you do very well. Did you do it with me? Did you try? No. Oh, okay. What do you want to do? I want to see the one again. Do you miss her then? Yeah. Oh, Baba. Who do you want to see? Dawn. Dawn. Yeah. Do you miss Dawn? Miss Dawn. Oh. We'll see her soon. Miss Dawn. We will see her again. So we are home now from the library. P3 said she wanted to go for a wee wee. Um, I don't know, I think I've mentioned it. We're like day five of potty training and she's doing really well. Um, she, we haven't had a single accident today. You did do one eventually, didn't you? <laughs> but it took about three times. Now the toilets in the library are up this lift. And right at the top there was somebody um, studying or doing some work on this table. So he must have thought I was like some sort of crazy freak trying to go to the toilet like a million times. Um, but eventually I persuaded her to go on the potty that I had brought as a spare. She wouldn't go on her potette that I bought specifically for going out and stuff. Go downstairs now, mummy. I'm going to go downstairs. I was just opening up your curtains. Yeah, so she wouldn't go on the potette. She wouldn't go on the actual toilets. And there was three of them that she could pick. Okay. Um, and eventually she went on her little uh, Winnie the Pooh potty, which was fine. Um, but like I said, I look like an idiot going up and down the stairs. But she didn't wear herself, she didn't do a winner pull up, so every cloud has a silver lining. Take the shows now on! Daddy, the show's on! Mummy's gonna move one. Wait, Mummy wants one. Okay. Careful! <gasps> Careful! Oh, Mummy's go. We've done really well. Oh, there we go. Mummy's the winner. Because you're the one that's dropped it in. <laughs> Actually, I'm the winner. I've got all the spaghetti. Yeah. It's currently half past five and we have just watched a film together um, and now I really need to think about tidying up. We've had some dinner, like some snacky dinners and stuff, but because P1 doesn't need to have dinner because she kind of eats like a snacky thing at her after school club, so I don't have to worry about doing like a big dinner. So we've all kind of eaten like chicken nuggets and bits like that um, this afternoon. But the house is a mess. Like last week I was so good with like housework and I was tidying up after the kids. I was washing up after every single meal. And just like since the weekend I've just not been bothered. And it's actually upsetting me again. I'm feeling a bit anxious and like stressed out by it. So I know that I need to do it. It's just I have no motivation to do it. I mean look at the state of this house at the moment. So we've got stuff like all over the floor whereas last week this wasn't like this at all like look there's like their lunch still on the floor i mean the sides again are all mm, got all sorts of stuff this is mainly hubby to be fair but all sorts of stuff i mean look at it i mean this last week was all tidied and all clear and it's just kind of got a little bit out of hand again so i think i'm just going to do it now take the bins out and things like that and then maybe it might make me feel a little bit more calm but i just feel so guilty because last week i wasn't really spending any time with the kids and i felt really guilty about it because i was just constantly tidying up and it's just this mum guilt isn't it all the time you can never win can you get down girls can you get down please Careful.
That is the scariest thing I've turned around to see in a long time. It's really spooky. Look. bedtime now it is about half past ten and I didn't film any of the bedtime or what I've done this evening I haven't done much this evening actually I wrote a blog post about um, the channel mums you're not alone campaign not because I'm working with them or anything but because they've kind of made me think about things so I did a little post um, about that and now I'm gonna take my makeup off and go to bed so thank you for joining me on my day in the life today and i hopefully will see you soon